Hi friends, how are you today? Do you remember me? I hope so, I think you remember me. Is my name Brian? Is my name Tommy? Is my name Spaghetti Tommy? No, my name is Tommy. Today, I will talk about clean environment and dirty environment. Mean that it's about environments today. It's a little tricky. There we go. So now, are you ready? Let's take a short break and come back. And now, first, I will talk about environments. Environments are the place that we live. The environment is made out of land. It is land. The environment is made out of water. This is just like this clean water. This is this water you use when you want to uh, uh, wash your hands. But this is also a kind of water. And it is also made of hair. The air that we breathe is called oxygen. So if you keep these keep things clean, you can have a existential survival of planet Earth. So only the planet Earth is the one that you live in. Some people live on Mars. But Mars can be very thin. So do not go to Mars. Mars will make you thin. Mars will break your things. Everything. And now. And now, I will talk about clean environment. The environments are clean, are called clean environments. These clean environments have all life. It has life for animals, plants, people, and many other things that live in trees. So, we have to keep our environment clean. When our environment is clean, lots of fish live in there. So, there will be more space. And if you pollute the water, fish will die off. Means you don't have any fish to eat. And and now I will talk about the dirty environment or unhealthy environment. <clears throat> The environment that is unhealthy means that it has factories, it has, um, it has all kinds of fires, they pollute the water, but this is almost polluting because it's only polluting in the dirty environment they pollute is when they to release all the things that they need, they don't need. So all the trash will be fell into a dirty pond. So you have to keep the environment clean. And now I will talk about this. The trees that give us unbreathable <coughs> that helps us put unbreathable uh, carbon dioxide have been chopped here and here. Chopped always. So they have been chopped. So you have to plant more trees. And now 
Do you know what's global warming? We'll study global warming in the end of the lesson, right? Now let's go up. We need to clean and dirty environments first. And clean environments have trees. Green and lush trees that give us fresh air to breathe. But the tree we cut them does not give the air that we breathe. Oops, everything was fair. So we just our hand it here, right? Now let's talk about more. In the unhealthy environment, the streams are dirty, the ponds are dirty, the lakes are dirty. So we need to keep the environment clean. And we have to clean the environment. So, the environment is clean, right? Right? And now I will talk about global warming. When the carbon dioxide that we, we release into the earth is heating planet up, Earth up. That that fuel is called global warming. You say it, global warming. When, when it warms up, when the earth warms up, then all the ice at North and South Pole, they will melt. So we need to keep the environment clean and do not put hot gases into the air. So that's why polar animals, such as polar bears, penguins, seals, sea lions, are struggling to survive. Let's talk about what will happen when you pollute the water or any other thing. So if you pollute the water or any other things or chop down trees, you cannot survive. I cannot survive. Animals cannot survive. Do you know why? Because if you pollute water, then the animals inside the water will think that that is food. They will chop it and they will die. And if we chop down trees, then there will be no air. So we cannot breathe. So that's why we can die. So now, what did you learn in this lesson? What did you learn in this lesson? Did you learn um, how, uh, how to clean the environment? Do you learn how to clean the environment in this lesson? Or do you learn how to pollute the environment in this lesson? Yes, that's right. You learn how to clean the environment when everybody pollutes it. I also, you also learn that you have to protect planet Earth. Do not get too hot. So all polar animals can can survive safely and they could not struggle. So now it's the end of today's lesson. So if you want to watch more of my lessons about environments, clean environments, dirty environments, and global warming. You can search on YouTube for me at Study English with Tommy, T-O-M-M-Y, Tommy. So, see you.